Hello everyone, it's George from Ireland outside the Cavalry and Guards Club. You can maybe see the words on the flag, Cavalry and Guards Club, and the cross lances with the red and white uh, pennants on the end of them. Uh, then the, um, the garter around it on his Cavalry and Guards Club, it says, and then that silver star in the middle with the crown in the middle of that, all in a blue field. So anyway, here we are in Piccadilly, and this is the Cavalry and Guards Club, with these flowers in the windows. There it goes along, and here showing you how it goes up. So, ooh, I'll zoom out, and that's how high it goes, okay? This is a four-story building. Anyway, because of the glare off the windows, you can't really see, but there are plenty of framed portraits on the walls. So this is for cavalry officers, the household cavalry, the two regiments, the, the blues uh, and royals, and then there's the lifeguards. And then it says on these things, cavalry and guards club. You can see my reflection, look at Medusa down there. Um, so everything ooh, is kept spick and span and well polished. Never been in, not being a cavalry or guards officer. Officers only allowed into this club. So we're right in the heart of London and they've got the shutters down. This is one of the sunniest days ever. But, uh, ooh. So you have to be, you have to be a suit, to, uh, wearing a suit to go in there. Now there are other cavalry regiments in the British Army, nominally cavalry, I don't know, the Lancers. But I don't know if they even care, have anything to do with horses these days. I shan't go in. That's as quick as I can go in. Oh my god, automatically opened. Better beat a hasty retreat. A cavalry man's gonna come with his saber or lance to kill me. There you are. Sadly, I can't, you know, film anymore or zoom in anymore. And that's it. What a central location you have. The sun I'm going in to socialize. Wouldn't be my bag. And it's across the street from, um, from Green Park. And just through that park, half a mile away, is Buckingham Palace. And just uh, the street here is a rather more down market RAF, saying, oh, they don't have traditions, they have habits or whatever. Some of them are very snobby. Um, because um, that was that. It was a, the Royal Navy's a senior service, then obviously the um, army was created, and then finally the Royal Air Force, only on April Fool's Day 1918. Their sky blue flag, it says 2018, and well, 1918. Oh, come on, flutter the right way. That's a bit too windy for me. I'm going to turn up the, going to make it brighter.